called In My Feelings, which include a classic bops like Finisher, Brujeria, and I Don't Wanna Brag. The best part. <clears throat> I have like all my liquids with me. Mm. Ow. I just put this earring in and it really freaking hurt. Actually, before I get into this, I really. <laughs> Uh, so the last video I did was my uh, house update. So I took you around the house. My camera, I found the charger. I'm a dumb bitch. <laughs> it was like right on my, it was basically on the fireplace in uh, the bedroom, but in like a bag. So I just didn't think to look in there. So I was filming all of my stuff on my phone, which is fine. But when the lighting's like, the lighting's not great now, like on the phone, it would be bad, but on the camera it's better. Um, so yeah, so that happened. What else happened? Oh, I just watched uh, Drag Race UK versus the world. I'm watching season 14 and UK versus the world simultaneously. And to me, UK versus the world is just my car alarm. Okay, stop. UK vs. the world is so much more interesting. I'm loving season 14, but it's just not got enough spice for me at the moment, whereas UK vs. the world definitely does. However, Lemon and Jimbo are my absolute faves. I do love Pangina as well, but Pangina has sent Lemon and Jimbo home, so that really annoyed me. Um, so yeah, Jimbo just left, and I'm so mad. I'm so mad. I love watching Jimbo every week, and it's been taken away from me. Uh, but that's fine, because I love Pangaro as well, so... Mm. So... This video is about the Balenciaga Defenders, mainly. Uh, I posted a reels of them, uh, but a lot of people were asking for the kind of full review. So that is what today is. So I managed to get these just off the website. Like, I just googled Balenciaga Defender, because I've known they're coming out for a long time, and I'm really looking forward to them. They're from the Summer 22 show, which was like the red carpet. Um, the red carpet show, like where all the guests and the models were like intertwined um, for the red carpet, which was really cool. So the Defenders were in that, but I think they were only in the black, like on the actual runway. Whereas I picked up the beige. Uh, you know, I love a white pair of sneakers and I feel like I can style them with a lot more. Cause I had like the Prada, what were they called? Thunder? Like Thunder something? I forgot them now. I had them in black and I never wore them just because a black sneaker to me was... Um, I just didn't like it. So I wish they did these in white as well but they just come in beige or black at the moment. But we know what Balenciaga is like for releasing things in other colours. Also, I felt like I had to post the homeware update in between because my last video was like two weeks before the homeware one and it was the Trooper Boot video. And then this one is the Defender video. And then like, I guess towards the end of last year, I had like the Expander video and the Runner video. <laughs> it's just like, I'm on the very edge of this YouTube channel becoming a Balenciaga stan account, which I'm absolutely fine with. Like, that's just how I am. I'm like obsessed, so. I can't help it, uh, but I will talk about other brands and other clothes when I buy them. Um, but yeah, so I picked up the Defenders. I actually went, they look like the exact same shape on top as the Expander, like... Like to illustrate what I mean, like this part of the shoe looks exactly the same. So I figured they'd be similar sizing and I actually asked um, another, I actually asked someone that I follow on Instagram, his name is like Lucas, I believe, um, and he already had the Defenders as well, so I asked him, I was like, are they similar sizes to like Expanders and Master Boots and stuff, and he said yes, so I went with a 42, because we know I had trouble with the Trooper Boots. But here is the box. Oh. 
Then a lot of Plus Hour sneakers have been coming with these. This looks really big though, actually. Instead of a dust bag, they come with this like gym drawstring bag, which I actually really like. I haven't used any of them yet though, but I really should just like do groceries or something instead of a tote bag, because that's kind of chic. So I read that they are based, uh, like the inspiration is from a tire, like of a car. And someone in the comments on Instagram was like, it's giving Michelin Man, like Balenciaga X Michelin Man. Why is this not focusing? Uh, which I agree. But you can see like the, the shoe bit is like exactly the same as the expander, but then obviously you have this giant tire around it. So normally like you just get this kind of tread on the sole of a shoe or a sneaker, but this is like brought up around the sides. Um, I feel like they're the same height as the expander or even a bit more. Yeah, I feel like they're the same height. It's giving you a lot of height in there. That's like a good, maybe inch and a half, two inches. Um, and do you know what the most shocking thing is? They're extremely comfortable. Like, I didn't think they would be uncomfortable because they look super comfortable, but the expanders aren't the comfiest shoe. The trooper boots are not the comfiest shoe. The runners are super comfy, but these are very comfortable. They feel like little boat shoes. Or they remind me of like, they remind me of like when my friends used to wear like rock, the Vivian Westwood rocking horse shoes. Um, I don't know if you know what they are. <laughs> but they're basically like, they look like little boats on your feet, really. And that is what these are giving me. Um, but I think the design is amazing, like I absolutely love it. I think they're a really unique, interesting pair of sneakers, which you know, I'm kind of drawn to those pieces that are more interesting and unique in that sense. Um, in terms of styling, I feel like I'm either going to wear like a baggy jean around it that just like goes over the, like hides the shoe a little bit, or I'm gonna wear it with like joggers and white socks so you can just see the shoes at the bottom. So I'm gonna show you them on like with this because I feel like it will be easier to see the actual shoe rather than have a pan cover it. But if you go on my Instagram and look at my most, one of my reels from the week just gone, you'll see me wearing them with like the baggy cargo trouser style as well. Um, yeah. Side note, they smell really nice. <laughs> they smell like fresh rubber. I just love them, I think they're really cool. Um,
I actually love them so much. Like the more and more I look at them, the more I fall in love with them. <laughs> they do look huge. Like they look massive, but I absolutely love them. Uh, let me know if you guys want me to do a 24 hours in these, like I did for the Expander and for the Troopers. Um, I honestly think it would be fine because they're so comfortable. Um, but yeah, let me know what you think of the Defenders. <laughs>